Okay, uh, so the changes are that uh, this is the latest dev versions, and uh, I added the, this recipe instead of the coming soon. Uh, I uh, used the blank recipe. So let's try. That's the blank. It's just a thumbnail. So blank recipe. What is the blank? Oh, this is for. Can I list well GraphQL stuff? Um, I made the place. So an empty website. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you. Uh, I received an email to connect. You can try if you want. Um, so I open the link that I received. And you can see that the blank recipe uh, doesn't have any home page. Okay. So in the email, I received the admin password. I can see your password. It's just not. Oh no. <laughs> it's not just that. Okay. So I'm logged in. Uh, and now this is empty, but I included some recipes. So let's try to execute those uh, recipes. So uh, these are not uh, setup recipes, they are actual uh, small recipes. So the first one is to uh, change the current theme. Run. Yes. Let's open the site with this wonderful link. So the theme has been changed. Okay, first first recipe. Second one, uh, create a page content type and... Uh, so it's also enabling the theming engine because the the blank recipe doesn't have the theming engine. Yes, yes. Yes, now there is, I guess, if I refresh, there is a design section with the, the themes. Uh, so I run the home page recipe. And now there is a home page. You can see it in the content themes. Okay, um, then I will enable the menu feature and add a menu with the home page. You should see it here, okay. Home, and then I will uh, execute all the, the recipes, so I will add uh, the layers And now uh, there are widgets, uh, zones, and you can add uh, some layers. I will create a raw HTML content type and add a widget in the footer. Okay. And now there is the footer. The footer is Euro HTML. Um, you can see that there is a problem in the theme. There is a dash 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 double dash dashes with the title. I need to understand why. Um, now you can add a post and categories and tags taxonomies. Let's try. Okay, so our new, there is a blog, there are tags, categories. I can go to the blog. Okay, so uh, there are no uh, views to uh, for the blog post summary or, or blog post details, so it just looks like uh, this uh, for the moment. Uh, and I can add a liquid page and create an about page. So there will be about 
page in liquid you can see about my site that's a liquid page with this uh, liquid syntax uh, i can enable the queries and there will be a new content query okay <laughs> To, to to fix it I don't I just just the, the type parameter I don't remember the, the syntax type so is, this is JSON type colon well in double quote type colon blog post okay uh, you get the ID uh, I can add a, a deployment plan to, plan sorry deployment plan <laughs> uh, and you will have uh, an, in, an export deployment plan to export all of your content. Um, that's it. That was uh, um, to explain how it works. Looks great. It's a good idea. Um, what I want is, yeah. I think it's missing something. First, Moody will find it because they will click there and they will see a blank site and. They will go away. So, mm -hmm. how to lose people is to show them this blank site. I'm sure, mm -hmm. like it is today, because no way they will go in the admin after mm -hmm. setting up the no way. Uh, then, uh, the I like the different steps that you have the different recipe setup files, recipe files. But I'm sure we will need actually some explanation for each of that. First, that you can click, but then some text to show to the user this is what you did with that and this is what the file contains if you want to replicate that it's like a tutorial it's like a long big thing like you no know, step by step these are all the things you can do on the website and this is how you do that with the recipe if you want to look at the example mm -hmm. or at least even if you don't want to look at the recipe it's like a guide if there should be a guide actually behind that one guide that shows you one two three four five every time what's what is this adding to the website? And that also shows you what you can add to a website, all the features. That's why I think it's great. But as a try orchard recipe, that's super weird. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe uh, we, uh, in the end, uh, we have just have a, a, a recipe, a bootstrap recipe, just to enable uh, a simple site uh, with all what, those. What would be, in what would be great with recipe? Yeah, what would be great with that is the, the feature that I'm made for Ocean one um, where you have uh, pop-ups and you say next, 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 and, and it explains what it does and it clicks for you or it tells you click there and when you click there, then you have a new pop-up and it shows you things. Remember what I mean? The one that uh, Lumbik made. Yeah, in Orchard One. Not their try Orchard, which apparently has evolved. I haven't seen this new version. Yeah, yes, that exactly. Yeah, and did that for Yeah, that mm -hmm. no, that that will help on this side to guide people. So that's fine. Then they they go on the blank page, but then they see that oh, I can type admin to go on the admin and. That's why I think what people might want instead, even for the other recipes, because otherwise they don't know what to do and they're like, yeah, cool, <coughs> there's a sign, what do I do now? <laughs> the other recipes are fine because there is a website. So we can see it's a blog and everything and we have an admin link, okay, let's, let's go there. But otherwise, if it's empty and they have to go to the recipes and they have to click and to look by themselves what to look for. So that's, that's hard. So yeah. Okay, that, that's good idea. So we will need something like that, like their, their, their module here. And that might be reused by my devs to create stories for their website, like to explain to editors, like there is a new editor that gets into the, the company and okay, just click there and it will show you what you can do, how to create an article, how to publish a blog post and things like this. Mm -hmm the staging then yeah that, that would be great okay good good thank you